All right, guys, what's up? Um, this is gonna be a quick little video on how to tin your wires. Now, let me just fix the camera real quick so you guys can get a nice shot of this. It sucks when you don't have a camera, man. All right. Um, let's see. All right, that's, you know what, that's good enough. Oh, hot side. All right, so as you can see, I already tinned a few. Well, you can't see, because the camera's not picking it up. Closer, farther, farther. There's a nice shot. Right there. Well, yeah, as you can see, I tinned them. All right. Well, those are tinned. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to tin them. Really simple. Um, that's a non-tinned. Okay. So, get your solder. All right. Make sure it's nice and clean. Get a little bit of solder onto the. I mean, get a little bit of the um, the solder onto the soldering iron. All right. Now what you do is, if you don't have like another helping hand or something, you just straighten and stiffen out the solder. You grab your wire, and you basically you just put the wire onto the 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 solder that's not melted, and you let the solder and push down on your soldering iron and just let the solder melt away and go onto your wire. Done. And then you can flip it over and do the same thing. Whoops, I just soldered it to the solder. All right, done. And then the other side. All right. All right, now just get it. Tin this guy. Tin, all right, I'll do one more for you guys. All right. And then I'll show you guys what else I'm doing. Uh, if you're really scared of soldering, because the key rule of soldering is try not to keep the soldering iron on the wire or whatever you're soldering for more than five or six seconds. Because when you do that, it starts heating up the whole thing and you'll have like stuff melting and your wire coating melts and sh stuff like that and that's not good and especially when you're soldering LEDs you can like seriously like like see right now I just put my finger on the thing too I mean right now I just have the soldering iron on too long and I felt the heat transferring off the um, the, the wire so you want to make sure you don't have it on too long or else you will mess up your wire and also you want to make sure you don't have this thing hovering over your body or else a drop will fall onto your no nose okay and I've had this happen to me and it hurt like hell alright so it sucks um, so just don't do it alright I'm recommending you guys not to do it and then if you have one of these you can just suck it out like this. All right, you just suck out the solder and it just dries up in here instantly. Or you can just kind of right here, tap it onto your sponge. Right here, I have a paper towel and just kind of clean it off, you know? All right, so now let me show you guys what else I'm doing. All right, so those are the LEDs. Um, let me show you guys how they work and let me test one out for you guys. Alright. So I'm going to test out each one. Um, not literally each one, but I'm going to test out each, like, each color and you guys will see. Alright. So let me find my tester real quick. Tester. Alright. Now, okay, this is going to be the Royal Blues, okay? Okay, so you can just kinda 
And I'm trying to do this and I make sure you guys can see it at the same time. So Royal Blues work and it's extremely bright. Alright. Here's the whites. Alright, and that's not even the full brightness it goes. So yeah, this is only running off two AA batteries. Okay, now here is the UVs. Whoops, I blocked it. And the reason it's flickering is because I'm not making a good contact. Let me show you guys the other two. And the camera is going to freak out, so please don't worry about it. And it's not the video. Okay. One more. One last white one. And I try not to look directly into it because it's extremely bright. All right, so that's all three, I mean all six, and that's how you test them out. So yeah, that's about it for this video. Um, I'm gonna have to say this is part three. Take a sip of your beverage. Calm down and keep working. So this is really not that hard, and if you calmly do the work, I guarantee you, you will succeed. So yeah, thanks for watching, comment, rate, subscribe, and be looking out for part four.